North Korea lashes out as UK sends aircraft carrier group to the Pacific. North Korea has launched a scathing attack on the UK after Britain announced it would be permanently stationing two ships in the Asia-Pacific. Last month, Britain said it would deploy two warships in Asian waters as HMS Queen Elizabeth and escort ships will sail to Japan next month through the highly contested region. The British ships will not have a permanent base, according to British Embassy in Tokyo. Now, the North Korean foreign ministry hit out at the decision claiming London should focus on Brexit rather than restoring its declining status. In a statement, the ministry said, The UK, which is intensifying the situation by pushing warships into the distant Asia-Pacific region, is using our threat as an excuse. It labeled Britain's actions as dangerous and a provocation. The statement claimed the UK is acting on an absurd bet that North Korea and China are working together to isolate South Korea and Japan. Kim Jong-un's secretive nation accused Britain of trying to restore its declining status, but said its plan will only cause opposition from other countries. They warned it could inflame an already tense situation in the Asia-Pacific. The statement read, It would be better for the UK to focus on the troublesome Brexit outcome, rather than risking others unreasonably for the realization of its political goals. Their comments come after Britain announced the permanent deployment of ships in the contested region. Britain's Defense Minister Ben Wallace announced the news in a joint announcement with his Japanese counterpart Nobu Kishi. He said, Following on from the strike group's inaugural deployment, the United Kingdom will permanently assign two ships in the region from later this year. Mr. Kishi echoed, We reconfirmed our shared position that we firmly oppose attempts to change the status quo by coercion and the importance of a free and open Indo-Pacific based on the rule of law. HMS Queen Elizabeth and its escort ships will split up for a separate port calls to U.S. and Japanese naval bases, Mr. Kishi said. In a statement on the deployment, a Pentagon spokesperson congratulated Britain for its commitment to an interconnected network of allies and partners who mutually cooperate and support freedom of navigation and a rules-based order in the Indo-Pacific region. HMS Queen Elizabeth is being escorted by two destroyers, two frigates, two support vessels and ships from the U.S. and the Netherlands. Mr. Wallace said Britain had a duty to insist on freedom of navigation on its way to Japan.
Britain has previously expressed concerns about China's dominance in the contested South China Sea. Beijing called on the UK to desist from provocations and interference with internal politics. The South China Sea is a highly contested region and faces claims from China, Malaysia, Taiwan, Vietnam, and the Philippines. Diplomatic relations between the nations are already extremely strained. Over recent months, Beijing has asserted its dominance in the region and has built several military bases on some of the atolls. <laughs> 